First, you need to have the following tools to apply a mold on graphic. Paper towels and our multi-clean spray to clean the part. Our MOG adhesive, the only adhesive compatible with our graphics. A burnishing pad. An infrared pyrometer. A flame gun like a Rypak or Starlight. And a mold on graphic label. Step 1. Clean the part surface with the multi-clean spray, wiping it clean and dry. Step 2. Verify the part surface is between 80 and 100 degrees Fahrenheit with the infrared pyrometer. Bend a corner of the mold on graphic, which will help to remove the carrier film later on. Make sure the adhesive tip is not clogged, then using a small amount of MOG adhesive, lightly coat the graphic. This will make the label tacky, but is not designed to make it stick to the part. Step 5. Place the mold on graphic in place using the burnishing pad in a linear motion to transfer to the part surface. Note that correctly transferred areas of the graphic will appear lighter as the graphic releases from the film. Continue burnishing until the entire graphic releases. Step 6. Carefully and slowly remove the film from the previously bent corner. If you notice it's not fully transferred, lay the film back down and finish burnishing before removing the film. Step 7. Flip the film over to use the opposite side to lightly smooth out any trapped air. Step 8. Using the flame gun, heat the part in an even motion, slowly getting closer as the graphic gets hotter. Make sure to not stop the heating action while using the infrared temperature gun at the same time to check the part surface. Step 9. Once the part reaches 275 degrees Fahrenheit, remove the heat and at this point you should have a fully transferred mold on graphic. Be careful and let the part cool before direct handling of the label area. As a final step, if you wish to test for fusion after the part cools, Place a piece of tape on the label area, burnish it firmly in place, and peel the tape back. If heated and fused properly, you should see no graphic material removed onto the tape. Now I'd like to show you how to apply a graphic in real time. Clean the part surface with MultiClean. Warm the surface part to 80 to 100 degrees. Spray a light coat of adhesive directly onto the graphic and burnish the graphic firmly onto the product. Once it releases from the transfer sheet, remove the transfer sheet. And now heat the graphic with the suggested heat source. To a minimum of 275 degrees Fahrenheit. And that's how easy it is to apply an original mold on label to polyolefin parts. Contact us today for any questions on labeling your finished parts.